This is a long sequence, too. I am very eager for this sequence to be over, or to find a safe spot, or something. It'd be great to be done with this. Oh, there are so many. Please let there be a safe spot somewhere. I don't want to do this again. And welcome to GT Not Live, where I'm getting my voice back, the game is cooperating with us, and it's time to make some progress through the Pizzaplex, my friends. Uh, for those of you who missed last time, we were probably at the lowest of our lows, where no matter what I did, I kept encountering that glitch. I did a bunch of behind-the-scenes work to get through and replay the entire game, including stupid daycare segment, which is terrifying at night. Um, but we made it through. And by a miracle, we got to the same section and got past the glitch. So, you know, we're, it wasn't the smoothest thing in the world. It was still, like, glitchy here and there. But overall, we are into a brand new section. We are underneath the Pizza Plex, and we're playing some squid game against some spooky endoskeletons. Uh, basically, red light, green light with endoskeletons that chase you as you look away from them. So, super creepy, super exciting, and super new which is what I'm most excited about because I played those last couple sequences a lot of times. So, ladies and gentlemen, join us as we explore the bottom of the pizzeria uh, because it's time to get going. I think we're on hour three, four? It's like four, no. What, in ter in, in game timer, what time is it at this point? 3 p.m.? Um, 3 a.m.? I believe it's, it's past 3 a.m. Past 3 a.m.? Between 3 and 4. That's like halfway, right? Halfway! I genuinely don't know. But. Great. Cool. Thank you. I, I, Matt's just staring at me being like, what do you want from me? It's like, I don't know. The, some modicum of detail. In, in, in theory, yeah. In games! I'm so... I, I hate myself. I'm so sorry. It's, it, is, it is a requirement of my life at this point that anytime someone says theory... Is that a regular Coke? No, this is a Coke... Co, this is a Coca-Cola Zero Sugar. Wow. Instead of a diet? You know, I've been consuming so much Diet Coke in, in, in December, does in that, November and December, that I needed to switch it up. Does that taste any different? Oh, <laughs> I know. My ass. Get get out. Do you have Do you have a palate? Do you have taste buds? What's the difference? Uh, this is very much. This is similar to a regular Coke taste, which is much sweeter. Uh, even though Diet Coke and aspartame is technically so sweet that your tongue cannot process it. Mm. So, I believe Diet Coke is technically the sweeter drink, but it doesn't taste that way because mm. of the limitations of the human body. Um, but this is meant to mimic the original flavor of Coca-Cola, which I don't like as much, but I just needed something. Like, right now, I'm, I'm back on Diet Cheerwine, this, green tea, mm. whatever. I just needed something. I... It's been a long end of the year. I don't know. It's I'm tired. Like I am looking forward to things slowing down in January. Like Five Nights at Freddy's and the holidays are like the last two big like pushes here at the end of the year. But like in January, we'll still be doing our uploads. We'll still be doing kind of like I know a lot of YouTubers are like I'm taking a month off because ad revenue jumped off jumped off a cliff. But I'm like no, I, I still want to deliver content to you guys, and I think taking a break doesn't make sense. Um, you know, for a lot of reasons. But it's one of those things where. You know, but but we'll die like doing three episodes a week of the theories and you know a couple GT lives that are pre-recorded like that is a six videos a week. That's a vacation for me. <laughs> Saying it out loud to myself suddenly has hit home how absurd that statement is. What am I doing? <laughs> what is wrong with me, Matt? There's a big moment of self-realization happening right. <laughs> This is this is this isn't a bit either. You've this is that level with Diet Coke where your brain is like, you're what's that pill? Quick, the movie where you take that pill. And oh, um, your brain. yeah, yeah. Uh, yep. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Mm -hmm. Limitless. You, yes, you've taken you've drinking enough Diet Cokes to where your brain is now on the limitless pill, and you can really like, <laughs> perpetually. <laughs> I just see everything. I'm like Jimmy Neutron brain <laughs> all the time. Big brain time. Yeah. Big forehead time. Uh, but yeah, no, the limitless pill. That's me. 
at this point, mm -hmm. clearly. But but the realization of like, oh, it's like huh, self actualization. Yeah, maybe maybe I could maybe I could slow down a little bit. I don't know. Anyway, let's go. Let's do it. Let's let's run away from some animatronics. Let's squid game some some endos. Squid game also, I'd like to point out, is already a game that exists. Like renaming <laughs> red light green light to squid game. No, it makes no sense. Man, I, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, I, yes, I know internet, I'm gonna talk to him about it. Matt. Is Squid Game not a game? And did, have you not seen Squid Game? No, I have. Did, did you pay attention during Squid Game? What, no, but like, it's, Matt. like Squid Game is a game that they play at the end of Squid Game. You, yes, okay, that is correct, uh-huh. So like, yeah, I muted the TV, so yeah, okay, like, thanks. now you can hear it. Thanks. Um, yeah, okay, so yes, Squid Game is a game that they play at the end of Squid Game. Yeah. But they don't rebrand. No, the whole. Th so you're saying, okay. <laughs> no, they're playing Red Light Green Light. It is called Red Light Green Light. Oh, I know, but. But the whole thing is just. But the you, Squid Games. But you're but, you're saying. I okay yes. You're making a silly little joke. I, that I would like to point out okay. is incorrect. Okay okay <laughs> yes, even though the whole series is called Squid Game, at the end, they're not actually playing Squid Game until the final game, and it is a one-off game. Yes, that is correct. You are absolutely right. Yes. I, I am I am I am wrong and silly. See, I'm glad that we did this. Okay, I, I am too. Am I though? I don't know. Am I happy about this? How happy am I about this? I don't know. Here, can I sneak past this guy? If I touch him. Woo! Hey bud. So as we learned last time, they move fast. So So this is what you look like inside? <coughs> Creepy. I like you yeah. better with your shell on. I like that we're still talking to him, even though he is he is clearly no longer with us. Uh, I need a button or something. I need a button or something. Hey, bud. Where am I looking? There's a TV. Is this a thing? Nope. Hmm. Where are we at? So that looks like a door. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay, let's see. Is this just a door? Oh, there it is. Great. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> Hi. Hello. So he's gone. Hmm. That leads me to assume that he resets to make way for the new guy in this sequence. I'm assuming. Hello. Oh, no, no, he's definitely still there. Okay, cool. Hello. Hi. Hello. You just, you just, you just hang out. You live your best life. Okay, who's seeing me? No one's here. All right. Nope. Is it just the one that I have to watch out for? I keep expecting there to be one, like, on the other side of me. Oh, there he is. So he's still kind of hanging out. Whoop. Ah, this is where it gets complicated, huh? Because now we're looking. Where's he at? Where's he at? I hear him. Oh, hello. That's a door. I love experiencing the game backwards. <laughs> Ooh, what's this? Hit the button, hit the button. Where you at? Is he coming through this door? Come to oh, here's another one. Hello, hi. This is tense. Ooh, nightmare plush. Hello, what? Oh, hi. You just came alive, didn't you? Oh, man. Here, you, you, so are you the one that I have to worry about now? Are there two of you? What is going on? I don't love not knowing how many of you there are. That makes me very uncertain. Push button, woo! Oh, hello. So you are alive, no, okay. 
Oh, ho, 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 ho. I hear another one moving, though. Or is that just my imagination at this point? Nope. Ooh, hi. Green light. Red light. <laughs> hi. Hi, guys. Nope. Nope. Nope, that's, that's the other room. Okay. I'm assuming the other guy is gone. I'm hoping the other guy is gone. Nope. Nope, that other guy's not gone. He's not. They are all active. And very eager to jump scare. Okay. This is a long sequence, too. I am very eager for this sequence to be over. Or to find a safe spot. Or something. It'd be great to be done with this. Oh, there are so many. Please let there be a safe spot somewhere. I don't want to do this again. No thanks. No thanks. P please. Someone. Oh, jeez. I have to hit this button, don't I? I was going to activate those guys. Ah! Stop! Yeah, you're, you're going to be active now, aren't you? Run this way. Yep, there you are. Just gonna wait. Wait, there's button. Hey, hey, hey. nope. Oh, that's a hide. It's a hide. I, no, don't prompt me for things that I don't. How is hiding gonna help me in this? Oh, jeez. No. This it's is the security office. Should be one of those badge head things in here. There is. There also. I would love there. To, oh, jeez. There would also, oh my gosh, why is there not a save spot in here? No! Oh, because this is guaranteed to be a mini game. Okay, level four. I can open parts and service now. Oh, okay. come on! Yep, okay, good, good. I'm glad that I knew that that was happening. Great. Get out. Stay. Stay back. No! <laughs> no! No! Not okay. Not okay. Nope! No! Stop it! Yeah, where am I? Okay, well, well did they retreat? Are, are, we, are we done with this minigame? Are we done? Are, are, we, are we good? Oh, no, my battery's dying. No! Oh, wait, there's a safe spot! Yes, there's a safe spot! Are they gone? I think they're gone. I think they're gone. Ooh, save, 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 save! New slot. Yeah! One and done, baby! Woo! That's... Oh, that sucked. That was really scary. That was really intense. I was... I was not a fan of that. Oh, man. That was... That was... So are they still active then? Oh, they definitely are. Okay, well... Well, we're done with that. We're, we're, we're done there. No, thanks. So I can open up parts and services now, which means... Wasn't that back? Hey, oh, oh, is Music Man behind me? Is, is, is my little music munchkin behind me? Okay, up, up, up. We're out of, we're out of running room. Go! 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 Yeah, Music Man! Get out! Hey. Hello. Are you deactivated? Maybe. We're, we're gonna say yes. We're gonna say yes. We're gonna say yes. Parts and services. Oh, hello. Parts and services was where exactly? I need to remember this. I can check the map, I suppose. Oh, yeah, there it is. Okay, great. I, I was the right way. I thought I was. Good. Cool. Whoo boy! Moving right along, friends. Uh, choose another spot, because at this point, I don't trust any spot. New spot every time until the PS5 crashes again. It's fine. All right, parts and services, here we come! I found him earlier and locked Ooh, him hello. That is great news. <gasps> he can be returned to his parents. He can't. Turns out there's no record of him. Don't trust Gregory. 
How unfortunate. If you reattach my head, I will go look for him. Now. Reattach his head? His head. It's Gregory. You know how I know that? His fab watch kept repeating in your voice. Gregory, are you there? Gregory? Vanessa, all the fast watches sound like me. Huh. It is the default voice option. That's interesting. If you're part of this, you're scrapped. Money you're scrapped to me! Case on your endo. Hang out here for a while. I gotta find that kid. Huh. Vanessa, do not leave me like this! He said if you'll put on my head, it looked like his head is on. <laughs> oh, this, this tank reminds, you know, this is a reference that you don't get, Matt. This tank reminds me of Star Wars. Yeah. Have no. you ever seen a Star War? Right over my head. Yeah, yeah. So Star Wars, uh, where, <laughs> where it's, it looks like the tank that they build Darth Vader in. And then he's like, no! You are here and alive. Freddy! Use the console to let me out. All right, use the console to let you out. I will do that. After looking for secret lore bits! After looking for collectibles! Because Freddy... Oh, yeah, oh, no, there's more endoskeletons? No! They're gonna... Oh, we're gonna... Oh, hey! You are loose. Are you gonna attack me? Oh, he's definitely moving. Hey, bud. Yeah, you... Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah, you, you do you. You do you, bud. That one's kind of cute. He is kind of cute, right? Yeah. The other ones were a little bit more menacing. I think he's, he's kind of adorable. They have like normal colored eyes. Right, when they're when they're not like creeping in the darkness mm -hmm. after you. Yeah, it's, it's much nicer. What is this? So why is there a prison cell in the mall? Sometimes kids misbehave, man. You know? Sometimes kids have issues. We That's weird. Here, you know what's weirder to me is why is there a level 10 security pass on this thing that is broken? And that you could just walk into. That's real weird. Here's a locked door. Here's a locked door that you cannot open and you don't have sec you need like top security clearance for. And yet you're still able to get into it no problem. That's odd. And this is endo body. You know what I bet they're doing? Here, here's my non-jokey answer, which is I bet it's all tied to like they're doing experiments on the endoskeletons, right? Oh wow, look at all this lore. Oh, there's so many bags. So much lore. Yeah, we're gonna collect these three and then we're gonna read about them. Boom. Oh yes, let's catch up on what's going on. I like that there are 10, okay. Wait, no, we've read these. DC inspection. We've done a preliminary inspection and find nothing wrong with your ventilation system. The loud clanging. Yeah, that's that's Music Man. Fire Dave, he sucks. My son is terrified by the daycare. Drink Fizzy Faz. There's a lot of good stuff. Stolen property. Someone stole Rockstar Row. That's the Music Man. Understudy. That's Monty taking over. Compactor. We'll need that later, I'm assuming, for Chica. Go to the staff party. Chica upgrade. Oh, weird. Maintenance log, Chica, don't let her sing. Messes with the navigation of other bots. Horrible results when she sang during a live performance. Poor Chica! She's like, oh man, her singing is so bad. It's like a sonic bomb to everyone else. Horrible results when she sang during live performance. Staff bots dropping, serving trays, chaos, guests injury, 12 lawsuits. Experimental voice box test fail. Huh, interesting. Roxy, Roxy sees things differently than the others. This upgrade was meant to help her win races. However, there are some side effects. Sometimes she'll stare and talk to the other bots through the walls. Ooh, so Roxy has x-ray vision. Doesn't help her catch me, though. I feel like of everyone, she's caught me the least. Monty upgrade. Montgomery's claw upgrades allow him to play the bass. Following performances, he mostly uses them to cause damage. The fence repairs are getting costly. Oh. Okay. I think I know what's going to happen. We have to get those pieces and parts and fuse them into... So I, I wasn't too far off. The whole, like, Monty's get, we're gonna get control of Monty and bust through the gates. We're close. It's, I think we gotta get Monty's claws, and we're gonna bust through the gates. And, and equip them onto Freddy. That's what it is. That's my prediction. I think that's what's going on here. Oh, that's cool, though! Alright, so we're gonna have to create a Frankenstein monster out of Freddy. A Freddy Stein monster. Ooh. Was that, 
was that an ooh of like, ooh, that's exciting, or an ooh as in like... There's a B in front of it. Oh, oh, there was a boo? That was a boo, huh? Okay, well, thanks. Thanks, Matt. You said claws? Yeah, Monty's claws. Please select your desired procedure. Power claw. Okay, I guess I don't have a choice. Power upgrade. Please enter the protective cylinder to continue. What? 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 No. The, the protective cylinder? Oh, oh, enter the pro- Oh! Uh, what they do to you? Routine maintenance. I'm functioning much <coughs> more better. I'm functioning much more better. Grammar function error. Perhaps I am still not at peak performance. Could you uh, reattach my head? What? I don't know. It looks it not? complicated. Just reconnect the wires. And be careful. I am not quite myself at the moment. Sus! In case of an emergency, the protective cylinder will protect important service personnel outside of the protective cylinder. <laughs> Deactivating animatronic safety protocols now. It is recommended that no mistakes are made during the procedure. Oh, it's, it's like FNAF VR. We're going to do the Simon Says stuff. Right? This feels like it. Is his head not on? I guess not. Okay. To reconnect Freddy's head, repeat the correct sequence by pressing the flashing connectors. Great. Simon Says. Good job. Now use the testing console to run diagnostics and complete the procedure. Cool. Hello. Oh shoot, what was it? I, I looked down for a, a second. Circle. A circle. Thanks. I love that we're playing Simon. I love that it's just Simon. Welcome to gaming in 2021, ladies and gentlemen. Here is here is the PS5. I am playing this on a PS5. Simon. <laughs> it's like not even a hard game of Simon Says either. It is red, red, red. Oh, uh, red, red. Green, red, red. It was all red. I know. <laughs> Thanks, man. Oh, you were making a joke. You gotta stop. <laughs> it's four reds! <laughs> yep. Nailed it! Got him! Get me up top. You know, I was really proud of my one and done animatronic, like sneaking through the animatronics. Yeah. Squid gaming us, otherwise known as red light green lighting us. <laughs> but best in Simon, that was tough, man. It was like the final boss. <laughs> red, red, red. Then what? Red. red. Maybe they were expecting you to like not believe that it was true. Like, like when you get a bunch of like trues on a true and false test and it's yeah. like, one of these has got to be false, right? Like... What am I doing wrong here? Finish the upgrade. Finish the procedure. Okay. Job. Freddy is all patched up and ready for the big show. Is he now? You may now exit the protective cylinder. Great. Thanks. Thanks so much. <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> Rocking. Finish upgrade. There's so much tech stuff in here. Is there anything I can use to stop the other bots? Oh, but <laughs> <it's laughs> just turned around and disappeared. I suppose a phaser blaster or a faz cam could work. Faz cam. Where do I get one? You can win a phaser blaster and phaser blast. Faz cams <laughs> are often Duh. confiscated in Monte Golf, Ooh. but you will need a party pass to open one of those attractions. Okay. Chica normally gives them out for birthdays. Check her green room in Rockstar Row. You may find one there. Okay. Use the service elevators at the back of the room. They go up to Rockstar Row. It looks like they are all out of order, of except are. for Roxy's. Sure. Okay, look for a party pass. Do I need to hop into you? I don't really, I don't. I feel like I've gotten this far without you, Freddy. I don't. I don't need your help. You, you go live your life, bud. You, you do you. I'm, I'm, I'm doing good. Okay, Freddy, bye. check out these pictures. Chica has some sort of special voice box. Roxy has new eyes. And Monty was given better claws. Yeah. We have to get these. What's Chica's voice? We can upgrade you. Gregory, those parts belong to my friends. I, huh. I would never do anything to hurt them. What? All they've done all night is try to hurt me. They get what they deserve. There must hmm. be a good explanation. They are not capable of hurting a guest. Which means we're not None a guest. Of us are. 
it would go against our programming. And also, see, they keep, they keep hinting at this idea of Gregory isn't what he seems. Gregory is not normal. He's got to be something special. I can overwrite my motion. I, I feel confident enough that I could overwrite my motion and save. I think I'm okay. See, the fact that Gregory wants to destroy them, the fact that, like, so are we believing Freddy or not? Or is Freddy just mistaken about his friends? I don't think that's the case. What do you think, Matt? Let's talk, let's talk lore. Um, you know, <laughs> I think I agree that Gregory is, is not what he seems. Right? Mm -hmm. He's not on the record. He's, he, it's, it seems like he's, just, he, he's a little sus right now. Yeah. Don't trust Gregory. That's my, that's my motto. Don't trust Gregory. I don't know if the game is going to deal with that or if this is just like left for theory fodder. I don't trust him. What? 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 Hello? What? Hello? Uh, uh, hello? Woo! Four block shirt! What? Oh. Don't get distracted! I heard you crying. I wanted to comfort you. I'm so <laughs> sorry. I, I wanted to comfort you! I felt bad! You you seemed really sad about your state in life. Forgive me! And that's why you don't trust a, a robot that cries. Really advanced stuff, though. You gotta admit. Yeah. You got a you got a chicken that's hungry, a chicken robot that's hungry and eats pizza. And garbage. And garbage. Yeah. And then you got a, a wolf that has self-esteem issues and cries to herself in the mirror. Like real, real, real impressive stuff. Also, good thing these aren't animatronic uh, spring lock suits, because the crying of. Roxanne Wolf would probably cause her to spring up and seize. Do you think that she can boil her tears and eat them? I mean, anyone can. Anyone has that ability, let's be honest. If you dream it, you can do it, Matt. If you dream it, you can do it. I hate that you dreamed it. <laughs> do you hate that I dreamed it? Okay, so I'm. Here. I'm not a loser. Aww. Who's there? Room. <laughs> oh. right, I can just do it this way. So there's a party pass in here somewhere. Party pass in here. Hey, hey, Roxy. Or do I just need to sneak around? Hmm. But like, really? Why? Why? Is this it? That looks like a. Nope, that looks like the top of an explosive barrel. Usually things are hidden in like... Is it here? They said in Roxy's room. Hmm. That's weird. Here, Freddy, can you get back in your recharge station or something? <laughs> I don't want to waste my, like, Freddy time on this. Do I need to, do I need to stealth? Is this a stealth moment? Am I, am I supposed to stealth? Nope, stealth. Nope, apparently stealthing is not the answer. Find the party pass in Chica's, or in, in Roxanne's. Oh, it's in Chica's thing. I, duh, duh, I get it. Duh. It's in Chica. Wait. I thought all of them. The elevator is broken and everyone else is. I get it. I'm in Roxanne's. That's it. Okay. That makes more sense. See? Escaping bloodthirsty animatronics, no problem. You know, red light, green light, master. Following basic instructions that the game provides you with, that's hard. That's, that's a struggle. I'm struggle busting hard with that one. Right? But honestly, as, as we look at the ethics of AI and robotics, Matt, yeah. is it ethical to give a robot self-esteem? Well, it's like, can a robot ever really have self-esteem? <coughs> I mean, right. It's a good question. What can is they? What self-esteem? What do you think? What, yeah, can, we, can humanity have self-esteem? 
Can you be sure? How do you know? The world may never know. Huh. <laughs> it's so deep. I feel like there would be no point in giving a robot self-esteem. Because it would encourage itself to get better. It's just like, why? No, it makes it weak and vulnerable. Do you think it would like go overboard? self is with the robot? Yeah. Oh yeah, sure. It's I mean, part of like what makes us human is like delusion. Yes, that is accurate. So if you programmed a robot to have self-esteem... Oh hey, there's Vanessa. You'd also have to give it delusion. Yeah. Otherwise it would, you know... Right. Down a really deep hole. This is this is deep, Matt. This is, yeah. this, this is deep stuff. Level 5 security pass. <coughs> I'm assuming this is the way I'm supposed to do this. Maybe? Level 5 security pass. Wait, what? Hmm. Okay. Where are we? We're here. There are the booths. If we go backstage, there's the tunnel system. Someone's running around. Yep, I hear him. <laughs> Someone was running! <laughs> Apparently, apparently, no, I'm just hearing things. I'm just slowly going crazy. Wait. Oh, the, nope, there's Freddy. Hey, Fred. Ugh. I think it was Freddy. I hate kids. Oh. Hey. I'm the best! What? Where'd you come from? Cool. All right. Totally fine. We're good with this. I need to figure out how I'm getting into Chica's green room right now, because that is not happening. I'm struggle busting it right now. Here we go. I feel like this should not be a hard challenge, and yet for some reason, it's giving me a hard time. I could try the vents. I know in the vents, the vents were connected at one point. I also know that through here now, we have, I have access to this back area, which seems important, right? Like, hey, you can now get past these doors that were level four before. So presumably that would indicate like, hey, this is a place that you want to go to. Woo, Gator Golf. Cool. This place is this, right? I would, man, can you imagine yeah. going to this? Do you think there's going to be a pop-up somewhere? Oh, this is so good. A pop-up? Yeah. Do like, you think someone will, like, recreate it? I, if, if they haven't yet, they need to get to it, man, because this is awesome. Hello. I need a party pass. Okay, so this is, so that's the Chica thing that I need. I need a party pass. But how do I get to Chica's? So this is Chica's kitchen, her bakery. Maintenance log, Chica feeding Frenzy in the bakery won't turn off. Even when unplugged, the game keeps running. There's no way it has that much residual charge. Chica's feeding Frenzy. Is that a game? What is that? Here, let's explore this little bakery real quick and then we can kind of wrap things. Oh wow, this whole, this is all just like Chica land. This looks legitimately awesome. Can I shut this off? Can I activate it? Is there something to do here? No. No. Okay, cool. Hey. Ooh. Bag of lore. Bag of lore. Ooh, Chica's reading frenzy. <coughs> Why is the Monty Golf a arcade in the mini golf course? It makes absolutely no sense. Is there something weird with the games? This is suspicious. The fact that they're calling out this game is suspicious to me. Can I put a magnet on it? Because the magnets seem to work. Or do I need to find a coin? To say insert coin. I have a feeling we're going to be able to play this game at some point. That's my guess. There have been a decided lack of 8 bit minigames so far. But I'm determined to play some. I was thinking, oh, hello. Hey guys, and welcome to GT Not Live, where we're still pursuing our pizza dreams in Freddy Fazbear's security breach. 
Uh, we are making a lot of progress. I think last time after kind of like the, the glitch slowed us down, last time we got through parts and services really fast, we upgraded Freddy, and now we're looking for a pizza pass. And at the end of the episode, we kind of like wandered off. We collected a bunch of cool stuff, but as far as moving forward, we're like, what do we do? Uh, the only other thing that I can think of that it occurs to me like after we ended it, I'm like, I should try the vents again because they're putting you into the green room area we know that we were in freddy fazbear's we started the game in the vents um and a after we turned off the the last episode i'm like wait a minute we've got a screwdriver that they gave you a couple hours ago at this point but and we haven't really used it because all the vents have been open but i feel like maybe this is a time where we have to use the screwdriver so anyway uh that's what we're testing out first i think it works um, that's, that's my guess here, but we're going to find out together, and from there, then we'll be able to proceed forward. So, anyway, without any, I mean, there, that's, that, that's it, you're all caught up, right, Matt? Any, any exciting things? Did you learn anything new? We talked about the ethics of AI, yeah. and giving, and giving them self-esteem. Talk about the algorithm. Talk about algorithms, and how you can discover new content. I think we've covered it. I think we're good. Mm -hmm. I think we're just into animatronic horror at this point, right? Yeah. So if you, okay. I'm, so like I said, I don't know if this is going to work. This is my best guess because I feel like I've explored a lot off camera. And this is the one thing I haven't been trying because of reasons. Okay, yep. So maybe it'll work. Maybe it'll only work for chicas. I don't know. I have encountered a couple other vents that I cannot open. Um... As I've been exploring, uh, I was, I, wait, wait, what? Music man! He was there. I didn't expect, he wasn't there the first time. I didn't expect him to be there. Uh, hopefully I saved close by. Yes. Okay. There's Rockstar Row. Great. Um, which is over here. Yes. Okay. I remember now. Um, yeah, I, so it's, it's been a bit inconsistent about screwdriver use, and so I, I, off camera, I'm like, what can I do? Uh, and so I, I went to the main, like, opening section of the game. I'm like, there's the vent there. I look there. The, the screwdriver didn't work anymore, so I don't know if the screwdriver is just, like, a contextually based thing or what. But anyway, um, now that we know that Music Man's here, we're also going to make sure we hurry up. I just, you know what? At this point, I feel like I should start every episode of Security Breach with a Music Man jump scare. Let's be honest, because Music Man is what everyone's here for. Not us, Matt. Not you. Not me. Certainly not me. Partly for the game, for sure. But definitely for Music Man. I think he's about pizza. Okay, there he is. So now he's, so now he's chasing me. The fact that he's in here leads me to believe that we're on the right track. It leads me to believe that this is the right answer, and that this is the way that we're intended to get to Chica's, Chica's world. Open. Open! Do I have to hold it down? Is this, is this another hold it down until it opens thing? Great. Oh, man. <laughs> another roadblock. Fantastic. Who knew? Who knew that this would actually be the thing that, like, throws us off? Uh, okay. I'm, I'm dying to my friend Music Man. I, don't, I feel kind of betrayed by him. Anyway, Matt, I was about to ask you, if your personality were represented by an animatronic in this game, who are you? Are you the loving and helpful but slightly sus Freddy? Mm. Here, I'm going to say it right here, actually. Are you the talented but hungry Chica? Mm -hmm. Underappreciated backup band member? Are you the narcissistic, aggressive Roxanne? I think I'm Music Man. Are you Music Man? I think so. Yeah. In my wildest dreams, <laughs> I am Music Man. I mean, one can only hope. True. Truly, uh, many aspire to the heights of Music Man. I feel like few I'm achieve <laughs> the heights of Music Man. I'm a Music Man son, Chica Moon. Ooh. All right. Wow. What about you? Uh, clearly. You're Freddy. Clearly, I'm a Freddy, yeah. right? Yeah, I'm clearly a Freddy. With a with a little Roxanne try hardness mm. mixed in, mixed, mixed in. Okay, so that didn't work last time. Do you know your astrology stuff, Matt? 
We've never talked about we, we haven't really talked about astrology too much, have we? Okay, so one of the gates. Okay, so that was the right way to go. Excellent. I'm glad we were able to, to learn. Uh, astrology stuff. No. I, 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 do, I know I'm a Scorpio. I don't know what my, ri like my rising sign rising. is. Right, I'm not sure what my rising sign is. I, in India, we went to one of the first ever... I found the point okay. gas. Well done. Well done. the recharge station you should be able to see their locations on the map okay find their locations on the map here i am there's literally one back here i, I thought there might be okay where where is it yeah back here great how come i'm the one in the recharge station isn't this supposed to be freddy okay okay oh that party pass is very special okay let you into Phaser Blast or Monty Golf. However, it can oh. only be used once. Okay. Great. How do I use it? Just give it to a party bot. They usually stay in front of the attractions collecting party passes. If you have one, it will let you in. I have marked both locations on your map. Oh yeah! We're gonna play some mini games finally! Okay. Mini golf? Or what I assume is laser tag. I think we do mini golf. Really? Laser tag, man. We spent so much time talking about mini golf the last time. It's only fair. But it's laser tag. Laser tag is legit. I hate laser tag. What? I hate laser Get tag. Get out, it's Matt. It's so much running. None of the equipment ever works the way that it should. Wow. There's some, like, nine-year-old terrorist running around. Oh, no! <laughs> wow! I did not know you had such aggressive feelings yeah, towards laser I tag. I really don't like it. Really? Oh man, I love laser tag. Laser tag is fantastic. Why? Why, why Matt? What do you mean why? Because it's incredible. You are you're using the power of lasers to fight against your friends. I mean, how fun is that? A laser, like, if if you were shooting, you're you lasers, you're harnessing the power of light itself as a weapon against your opponent. It's a glorified like red dot point. You're not wrong. I mean, it is. But if you shot it in your eye for an extended period of time, it might injure you. And it's a concentrated beam. Lasers, lasers in concept are so cool. Yeah. In practice, yeah. If it was the type of laser where you could see the beam, yeah. I, it would be a different I, I agree the fact that, they, that you can't really make out the beam is a bit of a bummer. Yeah. I will say that. I would agree with you. Okay. So... I don't want to trigger Matt over here. So yeah, you're 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 rooting Listen, for mini golf. You're playing the game. You can make your choices. Hey, get, get out of here. I just wish you would consider my feelings. Shoot. Well, I'm here. Well, now I need to. Now I need to consider the feelings of the animatronic that's chasing after me. Apparently. Okay. Here, for Matt, we're gonna do some mini golf, and we're gonna talk about windmills, and we're gonna talk about. All the greatest mini golf courses we've ever been to. Matt, do you mini golf? I've I've been known. I dabble. You you dabble. You 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 dabble with the mini. Not enough to be like this is my favorite course. Yeah. Really? Yeah. No, don't you don't have like a personal favorite? Because I feel like mini golf. I feel like mini golf courses actually have a very high hit miss ratio. Like there is, there are very clear ways to do mini golf right and very clear ways to do mini golf wrong. Like, for me, one of the things... Yes! It's so cool every time I walk in here. For me, one of the things that immediately turns me off of a mini golf course is mini golf courses who don't understand that, like, angles and geometry are the game. Like, that is the game of mini golf. Level 10. What are these level 10 doors? I'm so excited to find out. Because a lot of mini golf courses, especially when I was growing up in Ohio, <coughs> lined the actual track with bricks. Which defeats the entire purpose. Yes. <laughs> Seamless. Seamless gameplay. Seamless. <laughs> I didn't know he was a magician, too. Go figure. Oh, that's great. Okay, Monty. Oh no, we're here. The security office in the back hallway. Okay. Since there is no flash photography allowed in Monty Golf, 
Fast camps are often confiscated here, mainly because they are only sold in Monte Golf. It is a very clever marketing plan. <laughs> Great. That's very strange. Cool. But yeah, so first and foremost, these mini golf courses that line the course with bricks, brick is inconsistent. You're not getting a, a steady bounce off of that, and there's so many gaps in the brick, it's, it's, it's a failure of a system. It is a disgrace to the name of mini golf. This is so cool. Sorry, I just have to appreciate how cool this is, and then I'll continue ranting about mini golf. <laughs> Here, I'm going to choose another safe spot. There we go. Look at this! Oh, this is so cool. This is so cool. Is, is that just the sound, like gator sound effects? Please tell me I get to play golf. Please tell me that this isn't just like another location to run around in, but I can actually play a mini game here. Cause this is awesome. And I'm looking for faz cams, but really, I mean the faz cam is secondary to the ability to actually play through. Oh, look at this. Yes, let's play. Let's play! Is this like a satisfactory mini golf course to you? You know, no. Cause honestly, it's, 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 you know, look. Look at all here, let's look. Is, okay, this is wood. This appears to be a wood texture. And so it's gonna provide you a nice flat surface upon which to bounce and angle your ball. Uh -huh. So that's okay. I will say this hole right here, is this a hole? No, this is a path. Yeah. So as I look at it, look, this is a totally acceptable, awesome hole of mini golf. Thematically, really solid. Loving that. Okay. A loop de loop. Oh, any yeah, that's cool. any mini golf course that has a loop de loop is worth its salt. That's I also, a win. I love the ones where one hole leads to another hole. Yes. Those were always really good. Oh yeah, where you hit it into a hole that like it drops spits you through it a tube. Else. Yes, so good. So best mini golf course I've ever been in. Cuz I remember Best mini golf course. Whoa! Yes! Yes! Oh, the, please make this a reality, someone. Whatever events coordinator needs to reach out to Steel Wool and Scott Coffin to make this happen, make this happen. You you have sold out for life. This is amazing. You have taken a video game and made it into just an incredible experience. Look at this. This is so cool. Where do I get my clubs? That whoever designed this did an incredible. Right, this is phenomenal. That would be really fun. I, the only bummer I have to say is like I'm sad that it took this long into the game to get to that because so much of it has been like the back hallways of the mall, which is cool, but like this, I got a go kart. I literally just got an entire go kart. Awesome, <laughs> but like this, this is what I've been waiting for. Like this is what I'm so excited about, and like from all the teasers, this is awesome. This is so cool. Okay, so let me sneak past there, because that's a, it's a new, it's a zero door. So I think I can get back there. I also see a lore bag. Bag of lore! Nice, okay. Um, but this is what I've been waiting for. This is great. Please let me be able to play this. Please, please, please. Please, please, please. Okay, Chica report. Uh, Chica's personality chip has always been a bit quirky, but the new pizza-flavored Monty Mystery Mixed Slushy Syrup has adverse effects on her programming. She's attacked patrons. Uh, employees and staff for it. It's recommended that Monty Mystery Mix should be recalled before inundated with lawsuits. No flash photography. Items will be confiscated, confiscated and kept in Monty Golf Security Office. Okay. So, best best course I've ever... Oh, we're going through some more events. Best course I've ever been in is in Australia. Australia? Yeah, Australia. And it was called Holy Moly. And what made it so cool was it was in, it was an indoor course inside of a bar. So the bar and the course interchanged with each, like we're kind of intermixed with each other. Whoa. And at each, so like you're, there are multiple stop offs where you could get drinks, um, but also like. Okay. He's, he doesn't seem to be hunting me right now, I will say. Like, right now, he seems pretty chill at level five. Um, but it's mixed in with the bar. There's multiple levels. Um, you can go, you know, under and around things. There's cool lounge areas that you can just hang out in in the middle of your golfing. Uh, the holes were, like, really fun and thematic. Just across the board. So, so fun. That sounds really cool. Yeah. 
Second place is in Medina, Ohio. They used to do this. I don't think they do this anymore, and certainly not with recent events in the world. But there used to be, that's the security office, but I just want to keep looking while I talk before we hop into whatever mini game we're going into. Um, there, they would do it once a year where they would open up the hospital. They would open up the hospital to, what, where were you from? Cool, well anyway. They would open up the hospital and allow you to mini golf through floors of the hospital. And everything was thematic around, like all the obstacles were thematic around hospital stuff. So they had like Pill Hill and there was like a big obstacle made of pills. Uh, you would, the gurney attorney and you would like have to knock it through like the, the legs and wheels of a gurney. Um, it was so cool. Okay, shoot. Great, thanks for that. Security badge. Got this. There's a lot of stuff in here. Investigate the vent in Mazer size. Wait, wait, wait. Wow, there's a lot of stuff in here. What's this? Oh, fast cam. It looks like an old camera. <coughs> that I'm gonna be interrupted by the. Press R2 to stun any bots. Must be recharged. Okay. Cool. Switch items. Press up and left. Okay. Yep. Oh, I got multiple items now. Yes. <laughs> That's hilarious. So, okay. So this is. So flashlight is up. Fast cam is right. And I gotta recharge it every once in a while. Okay. I feel like they're, they're going to prompt me with like a challenge here to get out of here. Because I got a security thing. Every time I get a security thing, something bad happens. She's new, new slot. Oh man, I got a, got a camera. Okay. Here, this was level five before, wasn't it? Yes. Okay, so stun the bots in the area if I want to. But it doesn't work on him because... Wait, don't let me leave. I don't want to leave yet. I just got here, and it's so fun. Let me explore. Look at this. How awesome is this? I wonder what happens if you shoot that or touch that, that like hidden speaker thing right there. There's gotta be a way. There's gotta be a way to play this, right? There's so much detail. In There's so much detail. Like it's it's a proper functioning mini golf course. Right, full out, incredible. Look. Ooh, look, I think you can hit the ball into, oh, yeah. Oh, how cool is this? You hit the ball up into this, like, pinball thing, and then it drops it out. So awesome. I am in love with this part of the level. This is unreal. Okay, I already got that. Okay, this is the section I've already been in. There's got to be a way to play this, right? They look at this. They even have, so this is the Disney thing that they do in Disney all the time, where it's a smoke screen, but they use the smoke screen to project images onto. That's crazy. Look at that level of, de like, that level of detail is unreal. It's un, wait. Oh, there's my people. Well, okay, that's fine. That's fine. I, I literally just saved it. It's so cool, man. So this also reminds me of the, the horror game what, Gone Golfing. Oh yeah, we played that on the channel. Right, which we played. Like, I feel like this is that. Like, I'm, I'm assuming if there is a golfing minigame, that must be, they must have done Gone, gone Golfing. I just want to explore. Like, this is, this is the part of the map that I just want to exist in. And this is the sort of stuff. Like, earlier, I think at the end of our first live stream, I said, like, you know, we were talking about... Where did you come from? Get out of here. We were talking about what our initial feedback was on the game, and I said, hey, it's not, I expected there to be more like mini games and areas. This is kind of what I expected it to be. This is what I was kind of mentioning before. Yeah, yeah, it's all no spooky spooky. Okay, you got me. Oh, I guess that one summoned Monty. Damn. <laughs> Every once in a while, 
Monty comes comes a calling. Shoot. All right. Yeah, yeah. All right. I'll be I'll be more careful. I'm just I'm just in a rush. I just want to experience this. It's incredible. Um, but yeah. So, hos the the hospital would let us go through, which was incredible. Um, it feels like very much a product of its time and something that you would never be able to get away with nowadays. It sounds kind of dark too. Through the hospital. Actually, uh, I would say quite the opposite. It was, it was a way to demystify and de-stigmatize the hospital to, to me. Yeah. Because it's like, how often are you going into a hospital? To like, like an, have fun. Yeah, to have fun and also like that deep into it. Because like we were going through like the bowels and we were going into like, like a surgical room and this and that. Yeah. And it's one of those things where like, I had never seen a lot of that. And if I ever needed to go in, now all of a sudden, I'm familiar with it, I'm comfortable with it, yeah. it's fun. You have like positive memories yeah. associated with right, it. Right, because hospitals are such scary places normally. I'm so bummed that we're leaving so soon. There's got, I, please tell me later there's a mini golf game. Please, 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 please. Um, but yeah, exactly to your point. So to me, I felt more comfortable because I knew the hospital at that point. Unfortunately, I never had to go, but I think had I, you know, had to have had a procedure there, there was some element of comfort and it wasn't just a scary black box that I was exposing myself to, yeah. you know? So yeah, there you go. My favorite uh, mini golf course is always like focused on the, the environment. Yeah, okay. I like the ones with like waterfalls and stuff. Oh, sure. Cla classic. Wasn't really thinking much about like the mechanics of the game. Uh -huh. But I was like, that's a big look like concrete giraffe <laughs> and i like that yeah, i like giraffes giraffes are cool i'm all aboard the big giraffe uh so i'm supposed to go to jazzercise exercise that's on the third floor isn't it maze size. thank you are we gonna get chased through a maze because that would be cool i would totally be down for getting chased through a maze now we're see now we're getting into the chunks of this mall that i'm excited about here we go let's go let's experience 80s glory at its finest Matt, did you have a lot of uh, associations with mazes? Or not like, mazes, malls. <laughs> mazes. Did, were you exposed to mazes on a frequent basis <laughs> as a child? <laughs> yeah, Matt, from a, from a maze... <laughs> How many mazes did you come across in your lifetime? A few. Yeah, you've... Well, because kids in you, the news always had those you, little mazes. You, oh, like, I'm talking about physical mazes. Oh. Yeah, we're talking, we're talking actual... I, we were a corn maze family for sure. Well, and the, the haunted corn mazes, yeah, yeah big part of, of my growing up. I, I gotta say, I am so excited as an adult that I can experience more corn mazes down here in North Carolina. Because oh, yeah. in Ohio, we had hay mazes. Mm. Not a lot of corn mazes for summer, or at least I was never exposed to them. Interesting. Yeah. They're oh. never fun. What? What? Hay mazes? Corn, corn mazes. mazes. Yes, they are. They're not. <coughs> you are such a Debbie Downer. They're, They're just, so fun. Like, here, one second. Let's let's listen to Chica. Play the game. Calories well, you mean? <laughs> it's a, it's a winning business strategy. Work out and eat at the same time. Who lift that pizza to your mouth? Lift that pizza to your mouth. <coughs> so. Anyway, you were yeah. blaspheming about... Because, yeah. like, there's... you. The fun of mazes is that you can, like, see what you're doing. I guess. Corn mazes are, like... You're lost in a physical size maze, though. Yeah, but there's... Like, that is, like, an impossible task. To lose someone inside of a maze? To, like, These get your buttons way change the maze. through a maze. Please. I wonder what the right combination is. Oh, weird. Lost child, don't get lost yourself. Stay in place and wait for help. Carry, carry plenty of water. <laughs> oh, weird. Okay, so we gotta fix the maze. Here we go. Messages. Find the maze. I still can't find what's making all the clanging noise in the AC system. It's, it's, it's the music man. This is the fifth visit this week. If I could reach that stupid vent behind the exercise maze room, I could get to the catwalks over Gator Golf and take a look. Maybe someone who works in the maze or size knows how. Where is everyone? Leo was the only one who had a copy of the maze control key, but I haven't seen him for months. Maybe the creepy bot knows where the keys, the key is. 
Leo was supposed to train it to work the maze. Instead, he tricked the bot into doing busy work under the daycare theater. Under the daycare theater. I'll check after all the staff meetings tonight. Okay, so it sounds like we're going to need to go under the daycare theater to get something, to get the maze key, because we're going to have to adjust the maze. Because, yeah, this is broken. Okay, here, hold up. Let's save. Sure. Nothing, nothing really happened. Okay. I will say, to me, the only downside of... There is a vent in this maze that okay. leads to the Monte Golf catwalks. I believe there is a control panel for the maze around here somewhere. Sure. Yes. I, I found it. Um, that being said, can, are we sure that I have to adjust this in the first? I'm assuming that I have to because everyone's telling me that I have to, but... I just want to explore this maze real quick because mazes are cool. But yeah, to your, my biggest problem with mazes is that they can never be big enough, right? Like, if I'm in a maze, I want to actually get lost. And there's only been like once or twice in my life where I've been in a corn maze where it's been substantial enough and complicated enough that it's like, oh, I am genuinely confused as to what my location is right now. You know what I think it is? What's that? I don't like being lost. Really? Mm -hmm. Not a feeling I enjoy. No? No. Interesting. I Here's the thing. As a control freak myself, I, you know, not, not speaking about you, but as a control freak for me, I am well aware of wanting to keep control all the time. However, however, it's one of those things that to be given the opportunity to get lost in a fun way and like kind of relinquish that control, I'm okay with that. So you don't like mazes, you don't like laser tag. I like go-karts. What? Yeah. See, uh, see, that's where I challenge you. I was going straight for the go-karts. Really? Yep. Why? Something about getting hit. <laughs> Something about getting hit. Matt, do, do, do we need to talk, Matt? I'm, I'm concerned there, about no, your well-being. There is, it's the same thing that you have with the mazes. It's yeah. like a safe car crash kind of. Okay. Where it's like, okay, okay, it's yeah, so all right, I'll, thrilling, I'll do that, yeah. And it hurts a little bit, but it's like, you're safe. It hurts the right amount. Exactly. Just Although, uh, you can get really hurt on go-karts. Yes, absolutely, you can. My problem with go-karts is the track is never long enough, the experience is never long enough, and it's like, you're maybe if you're going to, a, if you're lucky to go to a good go-kart, you get like one overpass. Oh, it, you see, get a figure eight. Well, there's some tracks around here that are like, they're big and like there's plenty of room for like conflict. For con, yeah, really. <laughs> yeah. Investigate the vent in Mazer size. I didn't see the vent in Mazer size. Is, but I got the clue that I'm supposed to go here. Please tell me I'm not doing this too early. Because I would be bummed if I was here too early. Can I read? Can I? reach this like clearly it's oh wait, wait i almost had it for a second on the trash pile yeah there we go i just had to leap from the garbage pit to get my signature freddy mask i is there something that you get for collecting everything in this game i hope so because i'm doing my best i'm finding as much as i can i'm assuming at some point too there's there must be like maybe it's roxy's eyes or something Comedy stylings of staff bot. All right. Oh, that's hilarious. Let's all go to the lobby to get ourselves a treat. Oh, there's the bag down there. Is staff bot the one who has the pass that I'm looking for? Let's see. Um, shoot. Shoot, what was I saying? I forgot. Oh, I lost my train. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Hi. Hello. Grab this a little bit of lore here. Oh, this guy, look at this good audience member right here. He's like, I am in it. I am in it to win it. The BB World game has been acting up. Customers have complained that it starts to glitch over time. I headed to the theater to fix it, and now it's gone. I never saw a move request. So there's some weird with arcade cabinets. We're going to have to do like a mini game with them or something. I guess I'll check again after the company meeting. That's going to be a, either a collectible or a, another ending 
or something. The game is very clearly telling us there's something suspicious. Okay. Well, let me find... Let me find somewhere... Like all of these... No. Hey. You are, you are highly aggressive. That does not open. Okay. Well, great. Who's, who's, who's getting me right now? Is someone getting me? Definitely sounds like someone's getting me. So I'm just gonna run. Woo! Let's go! Hmm. Basement over here. Oh, it's Monty! Alright, that's fine. <sighs> Alright, so I think we made some good progress today. I got through some endoskeleton stuff. We got through, you know, a bunch of Monty's Golf. Right? So across the board, I feel like, you know, we're catching up for lost time. We were slowed down by the glitch a little bit. I've been a little bit distracted with lore hunting. But I feel like at this point, we're, we're straight on ahead, right on till morning. And we're going to beat this game probably a week after everyone else beat it. But you know what? That's better than not beating it at all, which is the alternative, I guess. So anyway, guys, uh, tune in next time where we uh, alter the maze and see what comes next. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for your support. And as always, remember, it wasn't a live stream, but it was a video. A video for you. See ya!